iPhone metering is one of the most exciting features that have arrived in macOS 15 and iOS 18. The ability to let you access and use your iPhone on your Mac makes it a big deal. Unfortunately, a number of users have complained that iPhone mirroring is not working on their Mac. If you have also found yourself on the wrong side of the problem, let's try out some handy tips to fix the problem. That's it, let's get us that. First off, you have to make sure that you have allowed your Mac to mirror your iPhone. If your Mac does not have the permission to use this feature, getting rid of this restriction may help you resolve the problem right away. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone, then select general. After that, tap airplay and continuity, and then select iPhone mirroring. Now ensure that your Mac is selected to mirror your iPhone. Another important requirement that you must check off without fail is to ensure that the two-factor authentication is enabled, both on your iPhone and Mac. On your iPhone, go to the Settings app and then tap on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then select Sign in and Security. And after that, check if two-factor authentication is enabled. On your Mac, go to the System Settings app and then click on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then select Sign in and Security and check if two factor authentication is enabled or not. Next up, I will recommend you to ensure that your both your iPhone and Mac are connected to the same Apple ID. Just like any other continuity feature, iPhone mirroring also requires the ID devices linked with the same Apple ID. Therefore, make sure to check off this important requirement without fail. Then I would suggest you to disable enable Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Since Wi-Fi and Bluetooth play a vital role in helping iPhone mirroring work reliably, try turning them off and on. On your iPhone, go to the settings app and then turn off and on both Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. On your Mac, click on the control center icon at the top right corner of the screen and then disable and enable Wi-Fi and Bluetooth. Now check if iPhone icon has appeared in your Mac dock. If it has, click on the iPhone icon and then authenticate to get started. If none of the tips has worked in fixing the iPhone mirroring problem, try restarting both your Mac and iPhone. If the problem is due to a minor software glitch, the soft reset will likely resolve it. And finally, I would suggest you to update your iPhone and Mac as a software bug might be causing the problem. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone. Then select General. After that, tap Software Update and finally download and install the latest iteration of iOS. And on your Mac, head into the System Settings app and then select General. After that, select Software Update and then download and install the latest version of macOS as usual. And that's pretty much it. So, these are the best tips and tricks to fix iPhone mirroring not working in macOS Secure and iOS 18. Hopefully, you have gotten a better at the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like and share it and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and have a great time. Bye-bye.